What I want to do today is connect our Notion and Things app so that whenever we post a new database item in Notion, a new task list will automatically be uploaded into our Things account. Zapier is a no-code tool that makes it easier for anyone to automate workflows across 5,000 plus apps. If you don't have an account, there's a link in the description for a free two-week trial, so you can try it risk-free. Let's dive in. In order to get started with this workflow, I need to create a zap by clicking the button on the left-hand side of the screen. Because I want Notion to trigger a message in Things, I'll need to use Notion as my trigger. I can find the app by typing it into the search bar and clicking below. The trigger screen will then pop up. I should click New Database Item as my event and then click Continue. Setting this as the trigger means that anytime Notion sees I've created a new database item, it's going to run this workflow. The first time we set up Notion, we'll need to authenticate it with Zapier. Don't worry, it's totally safe because Zapier uses industry standards for encryption when connecting with each of your apps. I'll put a link to Zapier's security and trust page in the description as well. We'll then need to set up our trigger apps data. Under Database, choose the database you want to use for your Zap. I'm going to click Task List and then click Continue. In order to finish setting up the trigger, we'll need to pull in some example data. To do that, click Test Trigger. You're all set with the first step. Click Continue and we can start creating our action. Type in things into the search bar and select it on the drop down menu. Next, click Create to Do and click Continue. From there, I can select a account and authenticate things with Zapier. To do this, pull up the Things app on your phone. Click Settings and then select Things Cloud. Make sure the cloud is turned on and select Mail to Things. Copy the address that's listed in the gray square and then paste it into the Zapier authorization screen. By the way, if at any point you get stuck, Zapier's got an amazing support team that can help you out. There's a link in the description to their forum post for this specific workflow. Click Continue and it's time to assign our Trigger Apps data into the Action Apps fields. Under Title, select Title. Under Notes, I'll type in a custom message. I'm going to type a Notion task has been entered into Things 3 and then I'll click Name under the drop down menu. Then I'll click Continue. Click Test Action and I should be all set. Yep, there it is. This is ready to turn on. Now, anytime we post a new database item in our Notion account, a new task list will automatically be added into our Things app. I hope this was a helpful demo. Zapier could do so much more with these two apps than thousands of others. Check Zapier out. There's a free trial. Click the link in the description.